Bridging barriers without the stigma. A new grant will help those in the North Country affected by the opioid epidemic re enter the workplace through skills and job training. The money will also add an opioid grant coordinator. Local 22's Haley Boulay sat down with the grant coordinator. She joins us live in the studio with more. Haley? Lauren and Glenn, good evening to you. According to the National Institute on Drug Abuse, every single day, 130 people die of an opioid overdose in the United States. While recovery is possible for many who are struggling to combat addiction, sobriety and re-entering the workforce can be a challenging road. But that's where Kate Smith comes in. She was hired as the opioid grant coordinator and she focuses on helping folks looking to re-enter the workforce in three specific areas. Career services like helping with resume writing, training services like on-the-job training or work-related school and support services. Even something as small as like, you know, I have an interview tomorrow and I don't have, a, you know, a nice shirt for it. Uh, that's a service as small as it might seem that I can provide or to as big as, you know, I'm really interested into getting this into this field. Is there something that you can do for me to help with training? She works in one work source, an employment and business center in Plattsburgh and Malone. Live in studio, Haley Boulay, Local 22 News.